Hello and welcome to this presentation. My name is Lee Snyder, the product manager for the steel segment here at TechLink. And what I'll be showing is just a quick way to model in spiral stairs using a collection of extensions that are available for download on the Tecla warehouse. The first one that I'll show is called the Complex Polybeam tool. This allows me to come in and create helicoidal spirals, ellipse, or helix shapes by filling out the required information in the dialog box. So here I just have some examples already loaded here. So what I'll do is just load them in, define my x and my y axes, then my origin, and then it will go through and it will model in this complex polybeam shape as you can see there. And I have settings here that I'll load in on the left side. What I'm doing is just uh, defining what I need to create my stringers for the stair. So I'm just going to make this five feet wide. Once I have those both in, then what I can do is just copy them down the depth of the st uh, stringer there. So I'll just make them a foot. And then what I can do once those are modeled in, or once I model in any sort of polybeam, what I can do is I can use the surface generation between polybeams to come in and create the plate between those two polybeam shapes that I modeled in. So these polybeam shapes could be anything. I just made them a thin rod just to, to use as guides for creating this web plate. So I can just pick those points. It will go in and create the plate there for me, maintaining the web vertical. If I want to come in and unfold that, I can use this unfold blend plate tool that will create me a flat unfolded view of that curved plate there. Okay. The next thing that I can do is I can come in and I can model in treads for this. So if I want to just model these guys in here, I'll just pick these two points here, place that in there. And then what I can do again using the radial array tool where I can just pick the member that I want to copy, pick my origin values again similar to what we did on the others. And then it will go through and it will copy array that uh, tread play all the way up for me. So then what I can do is I can go through and I can add in the welds, additional cuts, connection material, begin to detail this out. There's just a, a quick easy way to model and spiral stairs using a collection of tools uh, that are now available. So we'd encourage you to go download them from the warehouse, try them out, send us any feedback that you may have, and we hope you enjoy this new steel development.